Hi everyone, welcome to the channel, Aries the Emperor here, back with another general reading for my Aries Collective. If you are new here, welcome. This is an all Aries channel for all Aries placements. Cross watchers are welcome as well. Just take in mind, okay, this reading may or may not resonate with everyone. 1201 on the clock as we get started, okay? Do not force the reading. Uh, Today's a special day, you know, it's a full moon tonight, an Aries full moon tonight. How y'all feeling out there? You know, it's, it's been pretty interesting in my world, you know, and I have been actually seeing some of these aggressive energies play out being, I've actually witnessed this, you know, and, and like I say in my readings, I can't make this shit up. Okay. It, it's written in the stars literally. Okay. But nonetheless, you read the title. Let's get into it. You know, let's see what energies are going to play out for you. I mean, how are you in alignment at this time? Um, and not just that, you know, take into consideration for real collective. All right. Your mindset going forward. This is like a, a new start for you, like releasing shit literally here. You cleansing your space, smudging your space. You know, these are all ritual practices that you can get into um, in this full moon activation. These superpowers, you know, you can get out there, activate your, um, I'm, I'm sorry, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, charger crystals, you know, that's one of my favorite things, um, especially um, during this uh, full moon, harvest moon, in, in, in other words, is, is what it's called as well. Okay, so let's jump into it. You know, I feel like someone is shedding their skin, evolving. Um, and sometimes when you do that, you know, it's a scary feeling. You have to leave some things behind. You got to cut some people out, leave out some old habits, make some necessary lifestyle changes. It be like that. I promise you it be like that. Um, but it's only if, you know, it's something that you want. You know, you could lead the horse to the water, like the saying says, right? But you can't make them drink, all right? And I'm not calling you no horse or nothing, but I just needed to use that as an example. All right, so let's jump into the reading. Let's see what messages come out for you guys. Um, I was going to say, I don't see the deck I want to use. All right, let's use the doodle. All right, spirit. What messages do you have for my Aries Collective next 48? This is give or take. Thank you guys to everyone who likes and subscribes to the channel. Thank you for all of your donations to those of you who book readings. Um, I do have a few readings to upload and send out after this reading. All right. So um, to those of you who I have not gotten to. All right. I have you coming right up as well as candle orders. Okay. Um, if you would like to book a personal reading, connect with me or shop the vegan soy candle shop, I will leave all of my information in the description box down below. Just click the arrow. Okay. And there I go. All right, collective. Let's jump into it. Spirit, what messages do you have? Next 48. She's on fire, fire, fire. Look at this. The fool card, Aries energy. I'd say you and your goddamn element in the next 48 hours here. You know, this is activated at its all time high, literally the beginning of your journey. And, and you could be in the beginning of just getting into spirituality or getting into knowing yourself more, understanding yourself and the feelings and the emotions, learning how to deal with that, you know, cause life can be fucked up and then everybody doesn't grow up in a perfect household. You know, you have to learn, um, different, um, what, what's the word I'm trying to um, survival methods, um, just simple things. I feel like, um, in the beginning here that a lot of us don't have, and we have to learn and sometimes learn in a bad way, you know, through experiences or get the short end of the stick here, but baby times are changing. Okay. And I mean that for you, you know, don't lose that innocence about yourself here going forward, even though they may try you, you know, one thing about it, this may be a time period where bat shit, crazy type of things are happening around you. Um, you are used to this energy. I'm going to give you that, you know, you are used to people throwing sticks and stones at you. So it's, it really, I feel like you're going to be putting people in their place and shocking them when you, when you have no reaction to them trying to play on you. You know, like the fool has no care in the world, you know, and this is somebody that has mastered the art of letting go. Somebody who packs light 
and this is um the energy that you may be going into you know fuck that shit and fuck you is what you may be ho hollering out in the next 48 hours when it comes um to you and your freedom and your dreams and your peace especially here you know because people love to try and come in and fuck that up you know especially when they can't find theirs but you're not going for that here in the next 48 hours you know you got some good ideas and you got a fresh start that's how you got to look at this right now and not only that you know there's a, a more good coming in for you to, to further push you in alignment you know you just got to get in tune with this stuff you just got to get educated you got to put your hand on something you got to put your body in motion you got to put your mental to work you know what I'm saying it's not gonna come the fool is actually experiencing and going through life and and not you know not being afraid even though you may not know the outcome you know but that's why you out there using your senses okay, we got the three of wands sagittarius energy your sister's sign the eight of swords um gemini energy i believe okay um, so like I mentioned here, are you shocking people here? It is like, um, it triggers they you working on yourself. You know, it is, this is, um, not something that you are taking lightly here. You know, the three of wands is, um, somebody who sees an opportunity for themselves here or sees value in themselves and is willing to put themselves out there in some way, shape or form into the world. Um, or whether that's becoming more spiritually enlightened because this is someone who is also uh, seeking some type of knowledge or truth here in the next 48 hours. So um, you could be educating yourself more here on something that you're wanting to adventure into or adventure to or work with. Um, I see you furthering, um, not just visualizing it, but actually I do see somebody putting something in motion here. Um, it's something that's going to bring you a lot of attention and focus in some way, shape or form here. Um, and, and not in just in a positive way in a, in a negative way, but not on your end. You know, this is, um, people feeling like they don't measure up. So like I mentioned here, they got to try and fuck your piece up and they want to try and put you in a mental prison here, but it's not going to go that way. Sorry. Whatever you do, you do it loud and you do it proud. This weekend and, and the weekend after that. You know what I'm saying here? Um, there's like a, a new sun on the horizon here. You know, just like there's a new moon here. I feel like this is also just letting you know, you know, every day that you rise up, get up there like the karate kid, man, and, and, and kick some more ass. You know, and, and kick these people's asses that want to try and come play on your mental um, here in the next 24 hours, you know, you ain't got nothing to prove to nobody. You know, this Gemini energy, they only got two sides. You are Aries, baby. You the boss. And the boss know how to run the show from the, the beginning to the end. You put that shit together. You know, they can only sit back and, and read the blueprint and try and figure out how, how you doing, what you're doing, where your energy coming from for you to be able to put in work the way that you put in work or look the way that you look or act the way that you act or them not being able to put you in a mental prison you know that's the 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 fastest way to take you up out of here you know they take your mind they take everything so i definitely feel like somebody is or has made the necessary changes here and you returning that shit right back to sender here in the next 48 hours give or take baby five of cups all right you take that shit back I return that shit to sender for you collective at this time here. I can't make this up. You know, now you want to try and come in and, and spill over somebody else's blessing, you know, and, and not realizing, not knowing where that source, where this water, where this liquid, where this emotion, where this talent came from. You know, this is energies out here self-sabotaging themselves in the next 48 hours here. But like I mentioned here, you on a mission and you in the mile high club in the next 48 hours, give or take. Take it how it resonates, baby. <laughs> the queen of wands popped out. Mile high club. If this ain't the phoenix rising from dust, literally up amongst adversaries, opposition, And not only that, confidence, vivaciousness. She wouldn't dare turn her volume down, her color down. 
her essence down. Next 48 hours, you looking damn good. You showing them how it's done. How to put it together. How to take it apart in the next 48 hours, baby. And look what the fuck is at the bottom of the deck. Queen of Wands, Aries Energy, the moon, baby, and a full one. But don't let that deception fool you. Like I've been mentioning here in the next 48 hours. Because it's out there. And they want to try it. They want to try you. Especially if you're going out, you know, by all means, enjoy yourself, you know. Um, but at the same time, this is about being aware, okay, your surroundings and your circumstances and your moderation, okay. Secret animosity, secret hate. Two of Cups. Thank you, uh, Spirit. This is Cancer Energy. Yeah, this is an energy of going out, dating, um, a partnership of some sort. The Nine of Pentacles, Virgo Energy. Give me one more Spirit. I feel like this is an energy of more attention or some way, shape, or form that you're getting or maybe getting here in the next 48 hours, give or take. It's like you are at peace um, alone or you you have, are making peace. Um, and in that, I feel like somebody may be noticing that um, and, and noticing the changes and, and seeing them in you and knowing that you're not playing this time. Uh, you're not playing with nobody out here, to be honest, you know, whether this is something romantic or um, it, this is just a vengeance, you know, with you collective, it's you versus you, you know, it's it's never about a second, third party here, but it does come to a thing where you are ignited um, when people try you, you know, and you have to put that energy, if there is aggression involved and you have to put that into something positive, um, it, you know, it's like turning your, your pain into purpose here. Um, and, and you being profited or you profiting off of it in some way, shape or form here. Okay. And I, and this could just mean, you know, just in general, you know, when, when people think they can do better than you and they get on the other side and they realize that the grass is not greener here, somebody going to be realizing that here in the next 48 hours, give or take, like you are the prize. Okay. Yeah, Six of Cups, Will of Fortune. Look how happy this little kid is to get that. Like it's a prize, right? Will of Fortune. This is your destiny. Like this is luck, lady luck. You know, this is good karma. Like this is um, somebody that makes you feel good. Somebody that you um, makes you think outside of the box, you know, makes you want to be your higher self, you know, makes you want to get into or change, you know, things about yourself here um, for the better here. Like this is the energy that you pushing out here for somebody or they reflecting on this energy here um, in some way, shape or form. You know, you are um, a spin of the wheel of fortune for somebody as far as your energy goes. Um, and they remembering that and, or um, they about to be remembering it because you about to cut their ass off and really show them um, who you really are, you know, and you about to venture off <laughs> into the sunset back onto your journey here. We got the seven of wands that just came out. You blocking somebody out in this, in the next 48, give or take. That's it. You don't, we don't align anymore. You don't match up with my energy anymore. I'm cutting all of this off. I'm putting all of this to a risk is what you're doing in the next 48 hours. You know, this don't got to be about romance. Like I mentioned here, but, um, you're being assertive 
when it comes to something, you're fighting back, you're standing up for yourself. Um, and you literally like this person is taking higher ground. Like look at all these sun rises that are happening in all these different cars. Like this is, um, the second car here. So this is like, I mentioned uh, a new start for you, a new adventure, uh, um, success is knocking at your door, so to speak here, you know, enjoy the journey. Don't focus on the end game. Um, there is a lot more for you to gain here. Um, and I feel like a lot of that is going to begin to play out. You got the wheel of fortune here. So that's something turning forward for you and in good favor here. So that's Jupiter. I mean, uh, we all know that touches, um, it could touch anything and it will be returning back into your second house here. So, um, is this could be a financial increase for somebody here, especially here and, and not just for the short haul, you know, something that's got some longevity to it, something that you can stretch out and, 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 and really turn into something that's yours, um, unique. Cause that's what the queen of wands is, or this is just in general who you are, you know, you in this energy right now, you should be in your element, you know, you should be feeling good about yourself going forward here in the next 48 hours, give or take baby, but whatever you do collective have fun um and just be aware you know let the haters hate all right you just came to play here huh <laughs> in the next 48 all right hit that like and subscribe button for more messages from me i'll catch you later ciao